Hi, it's Kelly and welcome back to Me More TV. Uh, today's video is a beauty video. I am doing Alana Davison's How to Look Good in Five Minutes. As you may know, I've done my own everyday five minute makeup routine, but some might say it's a little old fashioned, a little archaic. So I'm going to see if we can teach an old girl some new tricks. Okay, the first three steps where you prep the skin, you put the lip balm on and you use a primer. I'm doing it all in one. As I said, I've already already done my skincare routine. I'm just using a Dermalogica Intensive Moisture Treatment because it's quite heavy. The most important thing is hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. So that takes us straight to step four, tinted moisturizer all over the face. I use the Lancome. Okay, so that's the medium. And I also, you'll see that, and that's the light. I'm going to mix them because I'm sort of in between holidays right now. And then straight onto the face. Remember on the neck, just make sure we always go up, defy gravity. <laughs> Step number five is concealer. Now, don't do it if you don't have any blemishes, don't worry about it. But my version of concealer is the YSL Touche Eclat. You know I love this. So just putting it in those areas where those bags are, in the corner of the eye. I always just go around the nose and then just lightly pat that in. And what it does, it, it's a, a light reflector, so it's great for any dark circles just in there. Step number six is powder, like a translucent light sort of powder, to set what you've done. This does go against my DNA. <laughs> Only as a mature woman, I find um, if you have a lot of expression lines, it's just going to accentuate them. So I've got a really light sort of matte powder. I'm going to do it. Just very lightly. It's meant to set the oils in. I, st I don't want to lose that glow. Okay, step number six. I am quite scared of this, okay, because this is quite new to me. We used to put bronzer all over our face, all over our decolletage, when we had a spray tan or a fake tan just to get the glow. But this is combining, what Alana does is combines the bronzing and the contouring sort of all in one. I'm using an, a bronzer I've had for years, Elizabeth Arden. Uh, here we go. She sort of starts around the cheeks. There. And then I'm not going to re-dip because I'm scared. <laughs> and I'm going to come up here. She goes like that. Something like that. Oh my God. Right. And then she goes a little bit under the jawline here. I'm using the Real Techniques bronzer brush. It's a powder brush actually. It could be used for anything. But you've got to remember too but Alana and I have very different shaped faces <laughs> and she's like 20 years younger than me. Also, I'm using a, a smaller brush obviously here. She puts a little bit, I quite like this, a little bit of bronzer just on the eyelids. And then down the nose, a little bit down the nose. Step eight, highlighter. Again, I'm, I'm still learning as we go. This is a Clinique highlighter. I really like this one because it is a cream rather than a powder, which I think is quite quite nice around that area. So we're just gonna go around there. But this is the one my daughter used, but this is quite sparkly. So I'm gonna do one side, just so you can see the difference. So just around the eye area, a little bit of highlighter, just along the cheek and on the outside. With this one, I'm just gonna blend that in. Now you can do it, I know you girls, young girls, or do it with a brush. I prefer just that, to do it with my finger. Now what I do like too, she just puts a little bit just below the brow, a little bit of the highlighter, little brush, blend that out, and that one out too. La one last thing with the highlighter, which Alana does, is just in here. Excuse that, I'm just gonna use a brush because it's easier. That's where we get quite dark in those areas. Now, blush. Now we're back in the 90s, right? This is what I love. So the blush, um, Alana uses like a really nice cool toned pink. I love those pink colors. So this is really cute. This is a little Kristen Dior powder puff. Boom, boom. This is what I do every day with my everyday makeup, is just that little bit, okay, there, there. Ooh, a little bit high. And it's just doing the apples of the cheeks. Ooh, that's a lot, isn't it? Step 10, set the brows. 
Now Alana just uses a gel and she has beautiful young eyebrows. This is from Blink Brow Bar. It's really natural so you're not going to see too much colour but it will set my eyebrows. And then I use a darker one if I'm actually going to go out at night. So just putting that in and it just also gets the hair going the way I want it to go. Step 11, we're not going to do. <laughs> This is where Alana used like, it's like a white eye pencil or a lavender inside, which is like in the waterline. I, at my age, I, I just, I wouldn't do it. I think it's lovely and fresh, but I think it's a very young look. Actually, I had it done at a wedding um, last year. I had my makeup done and she did it. And I was like, oh! <laughs> Step number 12 is mascara. I love mascara. I am not giving up for anyone my Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. I have been using it for 20 years and I love it. My little beauty tip, as soon as I get a mascara, I bend the brush because it's so much easier to apply. So just, I always get the tips, get the very tips first, and then we just come underneath. I'm gonna have to tidy up my little bits, but we know what we do if we get mascara on our eyelid. What do we do? We leave it, let it dry and then take it off right in there and come out and no mascara at the bottom the final step lip liner so I'm going to use the body shop uh, lip liner and all you do my lips are still moist from the moisturizer that I put on beforehand just follow your own natural line and then I have to gloss it up this is Victoria's Secrets lip gloss it's a um, satin gloss and with your lip brush a little bit on your hand Rather than using this point where you can take a lot of the lip liner off with it and you're going to get it everywhere that you need. Now, what you don't do is this and rub them together because you're going to move all that gloss back up there and you're going to have two double lines and all of that. That is How to Look Good in 5 Minutes by Alana Davison. I'm dying to hear what you think. You can have a look in the cards. Have a look. There's my 5 minute everyday makeup routine. Compare it to this and tell me what you think, make a comment. And remember, if you've enjoyed this video, I do lots of other videos on paleo and lifestyle. And you can find me on social media at memore.tv. Oh, geez, oh, my boy. He's my big fat boy, your mama's boy. Oh, see, Alana, my cat's so much prettier than yours. Do you see that? Everyone has like a makeup face. We're going, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs>